All right, this is what happens when you destroy the matrix and you're writing articles that they cannot allow you to complete because it is so damaging to their matrix of lies that they are desperate to prevent it by any criminal means possible. I've been writing articles about how I possess DNA samples from the Nephilim giants and from the reptilian humanoids and I was writing an article on the realities of this situation and the complexities of the circumstances involved and including videos of the samples themselves and during this process they have shut my computer off over and over and over again to prevent me getting the information off. So I decided to make up oh, there it is before the screen can pull up the desktop and allow me to access my files and get them off the computer is dead. You think I'm making this up? Let's try it again. We'll turn it on. I was also writing an article about the G5 or 5G microwave Oh, there it goes again. The microwave poles that have been installed, the G5 microwave units that have been installed in the hollow fiberglass electrical poles, which have been installed throughout the Lamana Pyramid Complex, where I've been doing research with my partner Suzanne for six years now. And look what they do. They shut the computer off over and over and over again to deny me the right to use my own equipment to uncover their criminal machinations. So my only alternative is to take this down to the computer shop and take out the hard drive and have the files removed that way. And when I've done that before, with my previous computer, they did this too when I was making my documentary film on gold making and the key meridian systems. They allow the files to be removed to a hard drive, but as soon as that hard drive is copying files over to my USB stick or anything to my hard drive, they block that as well. So we'll just keep turning it on here and we'll show you how desperate these criminals are. So I'm going to keep writing my articles. I'm going to keep publishing what I can until my website has been pulled just like this and left like a big black hole because the matrix of lies cannot withstand the onslaught of truth that I've been bringing through my website www.human-resonance.org and if you try to go there and you don't type in the www you will be led to a fake dummy website which is a copy of the Spanish version of my website which used to be at the address www.resonanciahumana.org and they copied the contents of that website and moved it to the site that has no www that you will go to if you simply type in human-resonance.org this is another one of their little criminal games they trade, they've played to try to divert people away from the truth that I've got piled up on the English version of my website. And the pile is so great, the weight is destroying all of their lies. So enjoy what you can off the website, mirror it if you can, because it is soon to become a black hole just like these computers of mine, which I no longer am able to use. So I'll take this as a victory, and you can take this as proof that I do have DNA of the Nephilim giants, and I do have DNA samples of the reptilian humanoids, and the reptilian humanoids, in fact, are abducting me. They're abducting my geneticist, and they're abducting psychics that I've worked with, and they've been doing so since childhood in all of our cases. So seems like my run on the internet is up and now I am in the black hole. Share this information widely, copy the contents off the website, copy my books and create mirror websites if you appreciate the work that I've accomplished in my life.